This is how people say they'll remember Oslem Wilson best, playing and being a good dad. My husband was so trusting and so loving to everybody that he would take the shirt off his back and help anybody. So when he was like, we'll room together, my husband was fine with it. Wilson was an iron worker from Leakesville. His wife said he was rooming with another iron worker, Justice Clyde Morgan, while the two worked on a job in Tennessee. Friday afternoon, Wilson was shot at the motel in Brownsville, Tennessee, where they were staying, and police began looking for Morgan. They say he ran off. Wilson died Saturday. Morgan was booked into the Otago County Jail Sunday night. Latasha Wilson said her husband and Morgan had been rooming together since May, but the friendship deteriorated and they were going to go their separate ways. I didn't expect to lose my husband at 41 years old. He was a senseless act and to make it all worse too, it was her daughter's birthday. She lost her dad on her 17th birthday. Latasha Wilson says she and her husband were married for nine years and he cared for their three kids like he was their dad. I want my husband back. I'm so angry and I'm so hurt that now I have to bury my husband at 41 years old. We were supposed to grow old together. We were supposed to spend our life together and have grandchildren together and all these things that anybody, we didn't plan for this. Morgan is originally from Mobile County and has had several run-ins with the law. In 2022, he threatened a Sarah Land judge and finished serving his sentence at the end of 2023. And I believe if somebody would have put a stop to him and not let him continue to get out, that this would not have happened to my husband. A family left to try and pull themselves up after losing the man who held them together. Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.